This is the end of the line. You were clearly no match for us after all. What? You think you've won? The, the match isn't over yet. Not by a long shot. Such as Harry Snake's Comet Shot move. Lord Janus, don't interrupt me just as I'm about to crush these worms once and for all. Um, I really think you should hear this. Okay, what is it? I see. We need to look into this right away. So, that whole thing about the defenders and the strikers switching places, that meant nothing? It definitely means something in the anime. You get a cool bit of seeing the defenders trying to take shots and the strikers trying to get some goals. But here it means positively nothing. So there isn't even any action on the pitch since Lena makes that decision. Kind of bad oversight. <laughs> I, get, I guess maybe if I took a shot with Axel earlier on then we might have had some time to use the defenders, but never mind. I'm talking to the governor and demanding we get a new coach. Hold it, Kevin. Calm down for a second. What is it, Jude? Don't tell me you're taking her side! I didn't say that, but take a look around you. Not a single person was seriously injured in that match. Y yeah So? What's your point? We'd reached our limit by the end of the first half. Imagine what would have happened if we'd carried on like that. We'd probably be in hospital now, too. That's right. The coach must have decided to keep us from getting injured and make sure we're ready for the next match. That's why she went with those tactics. Right, I get it now. But is that really what you want? The Ryman Eleven fight with all their might, no matter what the odds. That's how we play. Not that you know that, because you just belong to Royal Academy anyway and you play like two matches with us. Train you? That formation meant I had loads of chances to deal with their shots. That's why right at the very end, I was starting to see them coming. And indeed, he did successfully stop two of them. My hands are stinging, but I realised it's not impossible to catch those shots. I just need to train even harder. So you're saying that Coach Lena threw the match to save us and make sure we stand a chance in our next game? And at the same time, she was training you? Is that what she was up to? Wow! She's incredible! Actually, no, I just wanted to mess around with you. I didn't mean any of that. You're just speculating to make me seem better than I am. Now, I have another important thing to tell you as a coach. Okay, coach. You're ready for it. Axel. You're off the team. What? What do you mean? You can't drop Axel. What's going on? I, I, I wish I knew. Okay. What's going on here, coach? You can't kick Axel off the team. That's right. Axel's our star striker. He's OP. We'll never beat Alias without him. He pretty much carried us for the entirety of the football frontier. How the hell are we going to cope without Axel? My job is to put together the greatest team there is. There's no room for Axel in that team. That's all I have to say. B but you're not telling us why. Axel, where are you going? Hey, Axel, wait! So you made a mistake or two. So what? We all have off days. You can always train with me. Come on, we'll start with... Come on, Axel. Don't you remember the Royal Academy game when we first played together? 
You were there for us in our hour of need. I know that with you on the team, we could play football as it was meant to be played. I knew that we could take on anyone, and I still believe it. Have you finished? Come on, how can you stand losing to them? They destroyed our school! They are our friends! We swore that we'd become the legendary Inazuma Eleven! Don't you remember? The legendary Inazuma Eleven. That's right, Axel! But we've only just begun! I... Don't make me say it again. I'm leaving, that's final. But Axel, you haven't told me why! I'm sorry, but I really have to go. Coach Lena was right. If I stay on the team, I'll only hold you back. What are you talking about? Come on, Axel. There's nothing more to say. <sighs> Look, Mark, I've got to go now. Thanks for everything. Uh. <laughs> Axel, I'll be waiting for you. <gasps> Ryman is OP no more. He's gone! Why didn't you stop him? Cool it, Kevin. Oh, I can't stand it! Maybe we'll all get kicked off the team too! N no way! Hello, Victoria Vanguard speaking. Ah, Smith, that's you. What? You found my father in front of the Parliament building? What do you people want? Welcome home, Prime Minister. Something terrible is going to happen. Prime Minister Vanguard, who was kidnapped in Nara, is safe and well back in Tokyo. However, his whereabouts over the past few days remain a complete mystery. They didn't hold on to him for long. Just what are Alias up to? I hope they didn't subject him to any weird experiments on board their mothership! Don't say things like that! Well, well, I see you kids haven't changed a bit. Oh, that was the wrong voice entirely. I'm investigating the Prime Minister's kidnapping, but the trail's gone cold. So the police have no idea why they let the Prime Minister go. Mark, I'd say the best plan would be to talk to the Prime Minister directly. You're right. He's sure to have the latest info about Alias. They did kidnap him after all. What's that you say? You're looking for an audience with the Prime Minister? Am I the only one seeing sense here? You can't just talk to the freaking Prime Minister like that. Uh, what do you think, Tori? T Tor? Ah, I thought I recognized you. You're the Prime Minister's daughter. Well, maybe I spoke too soon. It looks like you have an in. Tori, isn't this great news? You're gonna get to see your dad again. Mark, uh, go meet my father. Without me. Well, no, because we're not allowed. We need you to get in there. Him. I can't see him until I've defeated Alias Academy. 
But the least I can do is show you the way. Come with me. Looks like she's made up her mind. And she doesn't seem like the type who changes it very easily. Because I've known her for all of five minutes. Is it me? Or is there something fishy about Alias letting Vanguard go just like that? It must just be my overactive imagination. I hope so. Well, I'm not going to turn down the chance to meet the Prime Minister, hey eh, lads? I'm going to meet the Prime Minister, yeah! Oh, no. I'll just have a quick flick through. You can pause to read if you wish, but... Oh dear, all of the comments are from Jack at the moment. Here I was defending the blog in this game, saying it's much better than the blog from the first game because, you know, in instead of just Todd commenting, now it's got other people commenting, but it is kind of just Jack talking at the moment. But anyways, yes, we're going to go meet the Prime Minister, that's... Pretty honourable. You know, we gotta open the map, but I don't know where to go. Huh? How am I supposed to know this? I don't think we need to go to... T okay, it's just gonna... We just had to pick anywhere and we'd end up at the right place. Okay. Wow, look at all those price balls. Yeah, it's um, one of these scenes. Thanks, Sylvia. Tuck in, everyone. Hold it. Wash your hands first. All right, all right. Hmm, these are delicious and not out of place at all. Yeah, this is great. Calm down, you vultures. Don't smash. There's plenty to go around. Right, um, a, a voice acted cutscene. They really pushed the boat out just so Mark could hate Nelly's rice balls. Though there'll be a couple scenes like this in the game, just to remind you that this is based on an anime. But Mark, how long have you been standing there? What's wrong, Nelly? You look glum. Did you say something about your father? None of your business. I'm just a little worried, that's all. What if Alias show up at Ryman again? Father can be very reckless sometimes, you know. He managed to get quite badly injured when he was investigating Ray Dark during the football frontier. Yeah, I remember. He was hospitalised. We had to go and visit him and then it took him until the end of the game to get better. Hey, what's up, Tori? Yo, I'm hip. I'm the gangster, mate. You don't mess with me. What am I on about? Right, so we're about to arrive now. All right, children. We're almost at the Parliament building. Do you need to speak to the Prime Minister as well, Detective Smith? Yeah, there are a few things I need to ask him. Who thought we'd get to meet the Prime Minister? He's the most important person in the country, and Tale of the Toaster's segment in Challenger's approaching top ten politicians in gaming. The Vanguard of Justice. Why, that's a title I should have put in the segment. Yeah, I don't know how many people watching this video have also watched top ten politicians in gaming by Challenger's approaching, but I... Done a fair bit of work on the old Stuart Vanguard character, 
You may have even noticed that that character standing next to him, Detective Smith, also gets to appear alongside Stuart Vanguard in Little Battler's Experience, a fantastic 3DS game. But for now, hang on, didn't you say she couldn't bring herself to see him? <laughs> Daddy, you're okay! Victoria, I'm so sorry. You must have been beside yourself. What happened? Tell me! Well, that's the funny thing. I can't remember. Really? You don't have anything to worry about, Tori. You're safe here with me. But no, Daddy, I'm going away with Mark. We're going to be Alias Academy. W what? No, you can't. It's too dangerous. You're the Prime Minister's daughter. It, it's just too dangerous. A terrible calamity is about to strike our nation. No, our entire world. All the more reason for me to get on board the Inazuma bus and try and save us. If there's trouble, I just have to face it. I can't always hide behind you. But Victoria, you're just a... Just a kid? Huh, I'm telling you, Mark and his team are going to do it. They're going to beat Alias Academy. Beat Alias, you say? So you must be young Mark Evans. Yes, sir. That's right, sir. Hmm. You look like a fine leader of men. Thank you for looking out for my Victoria. There's no need to thank me, sir. I'm just glad I got the chance to play football with her. I really, really love football, sir. So much that it silenced the music. And why we have to stand up to Alias. <laughs> you, young man, are absolutely right. Yes, they must be stopped. Thank you, young Mark. I'll do what I can to aid you in your quest, but I need you to give it your all. Yes, sir. We won't let you down. We won't let them beat us. Very good. And I think I can trust you to look after my Victoria. If it's all right with you, I'd like to ask that you take her along on your journey. Of course, sir. You can count on us. We'd be happy to have her along. Thank you, Daddy. Mark, all of you, thank you. I mean, I just took it for granted that Tori was coming with us anyway, but yeah, there's your official confirmation. And now we're going to the place that Wild Junior High tried to spoil. We're going to Hokkaido to visit Alpine Junior High to get a new striker. What? First you kick Axel off the team, and now you're just replacing him? Right, let's get going, shall we? I'll be back soon, Daddy. I wish you luck, Victoria. I wish you all luck. All right, you all, let's roll! Yeah! And I'm just gonna hang out with the President the Prime Minister a little longer, because, you know, it's an honour and stuff. There's something the matter, sir. Oh, it's nothing. I was just thinking about when I was as passionate and single-minded as young Mark Evans. You still are, sir. Hmm. It's not that simple anymore. I'm sorry, sir, but could I ask you something? And who are you, exactly? Ah, excuse my rudeness. Detective Smith, Tokyo Police. I'm hugely relieved to see you safe and sound, sir. As am I, Detective. I was just wondering if you could recall any details of your ordeal in the hands of Alias Academy. As I said before, unfortunately, I don't remember a thing. I see. Well, that's all right. I was just making sure. Smith, wasn't it? Detective Smith. I don't know what you think of me, but I have to warn you of something. There's something terrible, a power far beyond our reckoning, and it is getting ready to move. Thank you, sir. Goodbye. One thing before you go, Smith. Yeah, there's kind of... Two Smiths, if you got confused. He's got an Agent Smith 
and there's a Detective Smith. It's realistic, it is the most common surname in the UK apart from Mohammed. That woman coaching the rhyming team. Haven't I seen her somewhere before? I don't know, sir. Maybe you saw her at a football match or something. No, no, not a football match. I'm sure I've seen her. I'm sure I've seen her before. We have not gone a hunt for a new striker. Is he the ace that we need? Something's different about him. Find out more in a northern star. Let's settle this, Janus.